All right, so welcome back to Alligator Kazooie or Crocodile Kazooie. So this has been a long time coming. So I thought I was on a comeback when I recorded episodes 8 through 10 on October 14th. The fact that it is now January 9th and my last computer died after I recorded those said episodes has proven that that was a lie. So yeah, I finished recording those last few episodes. Oh, thank you for the host, Wolfclaw. I recorded them, edited them, and I rendered them. They were ready to be uploaded, and then my fucking computer died when I tried to play some Quake Champions. Quake Champions was like, hey, you should uh, upgrade your video drivers. So I did, and it completely fried my motherboard. God damn it! So first order of business as a crocodile. There's a little mini game I, that I have to play. Long time no see, Wolf Claw. So, I'm co-running this game on the Xbox Live Arcade on Xbox One, and I was able to do this in one try without these shoes back here, which are the running shoes. If I'm able to do this without the running shoes, I don't ever have to come back to this damn level again. Greediest croc of all. Okay, so I am a crocodile, not an alligator. What the hell's the difference? I'll accept. If I don't beat this in one try, I'll just leave and I'll come back later. Later on. Whenever I get the whenever I get the shoes. So for this game, I try to stay ahead of him. Cause that's the meta. Just get in the way of all of his all of his points. And hopefully I'll be able to stay ahead of him. In points as well as physically. Oh boy. Okay, I'm not doing so great here. Let's try to stay ahead of him. Oh boy. Yeah, it's fine. We're fine. We're in the clear so far. Ah, uh, first game should be pretty easy, so... It's really the third game we have to worry about. Although... It might not be a, a one attempt and done kind of deal. It might be uh I think they let you, like... Like, not to start the whole thing over, but it checkpoints each minigame. Or each, like, mini minigame. You know, like, each phase in a minigame. I'm doing well, Wolfclaw. How have you been? So that's one down, two more to go. They do get a lot harder. So this time it's the same concept, but just avoid the yellow ones, too. And again, I'll probably be barely staying ahead of him. Yeah, yeah, come this way, please. I think he is slightly faster than me. But whenever I do have the running shoes, I am just absolutely breakneck speeds, so that he really doesn't stand a chance. The game is just too easy. Have you been streaming a lot, Wolf Claw? Alright, come on. Stay right behind me. God damn it. Alright, this should, should go in the bag pretty easy. I don't really have to stay right in front of him because there's just a plethora of of them right in front of me. Uh, I think I stay ahead here? Yeah. Easy peasy. You haven't been on Twitch lately? Was it you or the other guy who have been Streaming, uh, Friday the 13th. Alright, this minigame is a bitch. You get penalized if you happen to eat the one that's not on top of the screen. You do anyway, but he doesn't. Oh no, I accidentally- I didn't even- I wasn't even pressing B. And of course, this is where I always, uh... Mess up because I keep sliding around because I don't have any traction control. All right, turn yellow, turn yellow, please. Come on, turn yellow. God damn it. All right, I'll be able to get a lead on him here. Oh, come on, come on, turn red. Yes. 
I win! First try! Kind of. See, he eats the he eats the red right at a bad time, but but it doesn't penalize him because he's the boss man. And I did it. I win the jiggy. Hey, Johnny Nuke. Did you play this game a lot as a kid? Did you have a lot of trouble with this uh, particular mini game? Because I know I did. In fact, it wasn't until very recently I was actually able to beat this in one try without the shoes. Now I don't ever have to come back to Bubble Gloop Swamp again. Once I'm done with everything, this level is done. All right, now, all right, I'm gonna save that part for later because it's been several months since I recorded this. And then once I was ready to record this again, I didn't really bother watching much of my uh, previous, my previous videos. The only reason I watched the videos in fact, I watched them on mute because I just wanted to see like what I had done so far, so that I could just replay this level up to up to where up to where I'd gotten, so that I could start where I turned into an alligator. Sorry, a crocodile. Got to that point, said, "All right, leave it there, leave a safe state," and then when I come back to finally record, I'll be right at the point to where I was, so that. To the YouTube audience, it's 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 as if I hadn't even left at all. Except I'm telling you now, fucking it's been months since I played this. Yes, hello everyone, welcome. Thank you for dropping in the stream, and for all those on YouTube, thank you for dropping in on the video. Um. So I uploaded those three videos earlier this month. I, I don't have any views on them yet, but, you know. At least I have viewers here now. <laughs> Alright, I actually don't need to be over here. Well, it does make collecting all the stuff in a swamp easier because as a bear I, could, I wouldn't be able to go through these. Oh, I got all the Jinjos already. Yes, I do have a YouTube. In fact, the link is down below in the uh, if you're on desktop. There's like a YouTube icon down there. I think the remainder of the notes are inside this turtle. Oh yeah, as I was saying, as a barren bird, I would have to actually put on boots to uh to go in there. But as a crocodile, I can just wade on in there. I think I think this is all I have to do as a crocodile. I have to turn back into a barren bird because as I found out to my chagrin as I was playing the Xbox Live version, I do have to turn back into the barren bird to do something outside the level and then I have to come back in here to turn into a crocodile again. So that's annoying. I'll probably cut some of that out in the video. But you guys on Twitch, you're going to have to watch it all. all right, let me go ahead and turn back into a barren bird. Well, thank you, Wolfclaw. Yes. Um, oh, so you might be able to see on the very bottom of the screen there, like, just like, just like the tip of the YouTube subscribe thing. I don't know why that's all the way down there, but as you can hear, that's the sound of someone subscribing to me on YouTube. Yeah, I don't even know what your name is because it didn't appear on screen. <laughs> Oh, your name's Angel Sword. Thank you for the, uh... Did I just pronounce it Sword? <laughs> Thank you, Angel Sword. Where's the hole? Oh, I'm a barren bird. I can't just go that way. Alright. Thank you, Angel Sword. For the YouTube sub. Uh... uh... So I don't care if I get hurt, taking damage to save time, I'll just, uh, I just want to get there faster. I'll pick up health on the way. Just now at the 10 minute mark of recording, but it's no longer 2008. We don't care about the 10 minute time limit anymore. Uh, uh 
Let me remember my controls here. All right, so right trigger and left bumper to do the Talon Trot. Let's go hit up the turtle. Since you've unlocked the community tab, what does that mean? Oh, first let me uh, let me get this jiggy over here after killing this wasp or whatever the hell this is. I think this is the final thing that you have to feed. Oh, come on. Yes. Jiggy gets. Oh, yeah. Eight out of ten Jiggy's gotten. Oh. oh, thank you for the follow as well. On Twitch. Thank you, Johnny. Where am I? I've gotten turned around now. Ah, oh, damn it. Ooh, my feet are so numb. Yeah, I was probably supposed to uh, talk to his face first, but I did not. I just assumptuously went around his back and slammed into his feet. Oh, good. So this is the ninth Jiggy. And then for our tenth Jiggy, we must go in here. First. Um, I don't know if I've gotten the other honeycomb piece in this. I think it was in Mumbo's hut. In fact, I think I got it in video 10. And this will be in video 11. Oh, I don't care now. Okay, everyone help me keep count. Purple, red, yellow. Purple, red, yellow. Okay, good. Alright, so I gotta get this. No, I don't care! Ah, oh, I don't remember the skip thing. All right. No, I haven't forgotten. Leave me alone. Uh, I don't. All right, so easy enough. Especially if I get the uh, Twitch chat to help me out. And also, these are the last of the uh, notes. All right, so pink, light, yellow, pink. Pink, light, yellow, pink, purple. Right, and then it was pink again, right? And then purple. I might need a pin for this one. <laughs> All right, totally not cheating here. All right, guys, I'm not cheating in the chat, so don't. Fuck, I fucked up. Uh. So it was purple, pink, light. And then purple and then pink again? And then the last one was... I wasn't paying attention at all for the last one. Was it red? Fuck! I get hurt by that? Alright, teach me again, Sammy. I knew you'd see this one again. Oh, okay. <laughs> so there was a red, but it was after another purple. Whoops. My bad. I can't believe it takes a health off of me if I get it wrong. Wait, what? All right, for sure I got it this time. Oh, you know what? Never mind. It was it was purple first. I'm colorblind, okay? Alright, this time I got it. I got it, guys. I got it. I'm not gonna die this time. Yep. And then the purple again. And then red. Boom. 
Give me the jiggy. <laughs> and please don't kill me on the way out. I'm gonna find some way to die. But not before I 100% this game. I mean, not this game, but this level. And... 100 notes. This level is completely done. Let me make sure, though. Sorry for the white screen. I don't know how to make it... Okay, good. And I spent exactly 29 minutes. Alright. Uh, hey, if I die, do I start back at the beginning of the level? I think I'm just gonna kill myself. Alright, so... Um... And I did smash the witch switch in this level. Alright, so I do gotta exit this level. Um... But I do have to come back because I have to do something as the Baron Bird first. So, first, let's just die. here. Thank you very much for watching. See you in the next part. <laughs> All right. And I still got nine lives because it doesn't count past nine, but I, I do have past nine. So that's good. Alright, so I gotta go back into that level, just to turn back into a crocodile, but not before I do this. Also, welcome to part 12. Alright, which one are the, the boots in this one, right? Fantastic! And I think we unlock the next level here, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, that's right. Losing a life to save time. Speedrunning tactics. Because that's how I roll. We're just taking damage because I'm an idiot. Yep. This is... The path to the next level. And I think I could do this puzzle as a crocodile? I don't... Okay, good. I could do this puzzle as a crocodile, but here's the reason I need to become a crocodile, and here's the reason why I need to come here as a, the barren bird first. So, I need the crocodile to fit to this tiny hole here, but to break the boulder that, that blocks it, I had to bust it open! Alright. I'll be right back as a crocodile. See ya. Oh, you know what, guys? On Twitch, I forgot to, uh... I forgot to end the recording and start it back up again. So I guess this will just be one video that will break into two or three parts. And also, we're cutting all this out. Um... Next time the audience on YouTube sees me, I'll be... in the same place as a crocodile. So while we're on YouTube downtime, this is all something that only you get to see. So what's up, everyone? Oh, we have notes again. Wait, I have all notes here, right? Okay, I do. So why are there why are there notes back again? That's weird. I thought they'd be gone. Like in uh, Banjo Tooie or or uh, the Xbox Live Arcade version of this. Where all your notes save on exiting. Hey, <laughs> exclusive content. Alright, so I gotta do this fucking superf superfluous maze again. How do you pronounce that? Superfluous? Just to reach Mumbo, just so I can do all this inane shit. So I'm really glad after this, I'm not gonna be able to come. I'm not gonna have to come back to this level anymore. Kazooie, why do you turn me around? 
So the only reason I'm not in bed right now, I had to start streaming this and recording at 4.30 because I am behind. My last episode was supposed to go up yesterday and I've been kind of slacking. Because whenever I get off of work, I come home and I drink and I'll be like, Alright, it's time to, uh... It's time to start streaming and recording, but then I'm like, oh, I'm too drunk for this shit, I can't do it. Actually, that just happened last night or the other night. I got- I got- I got on, and I played for like four minutes. I went to that mini game that you saw me go in at, at the beginning of the stream, and I tried it, and it, and it took me like- Well, it took me infinite tries because I- I kept going until I died, so I was like, you know what, fuck this, I'm ending the stream. And I'm ending the recording. We'll do this another time. I'm just gonna go back to the save file that I, uh... That I left off on before, and I'll just pretend like this never happened. So, shh, don't tell anyone on YouTube, okay? Yeah, well, I wasn't too drunk to record or stream. I was too drunk to... To play the game well. And probably too drunk to be interesting. There's a level of drunk that I have to be to be the right level of interesting. And I'm not quite there, but... And it's too late to buy more beer, so, uh... So yeah, this will be my... Be my state for tonight. Can I just die as an alligator? No, it'll bring me back to Mumbo's hut. Yeah, I'm trying to find a schedule as well. Only problem is, uh, shit's really hitting the fan at work. So someone might be quit, which means I might be going overtime. Anyway, let's pick it back up here. Let's pick it back up here. Where, uh, we're almost at the point again as an alligator. Wouldn't be too far. Won't be too far from here. I think this is where we meet Cheeto. For the first time? And he teaches us a, a cheat to input at a treasure trove cove. In fact, I think he explains it when we meet him. It's because her brother's dim. I am not. I am not dim. The earth is flat. Yes, hello, useless book. With only four pages. Well, technically eight. Hey, book brain. Ha ha ha. Good one, Grunty. <laughs> Finders keepers. Blue eggs. Will someone keep track for me? <laughs> Help you, it will. Yes, like Yoda, he talks. Spoiler alert, there are two characters in the next game, the sequel to this game, that also talk like that. In fact, they convince Gruntilda to stop rhyming, which is, a uh, uh, All right, Rare, I guess, uh... If you, don't, if you don't have any creativity left in you, then I guess that's what you gotta do. It's just to stop the, uh... Stop one of the biggest draws of the game is, is the, uh... The antagonist rhyming. Alright, I'm glad we never have to go back into this level again. Oh, wait, my camera's getting turned around. What? Banjo, Banjo 2 is a fine game. What do you mean? It's just a lot longer than this, than this game. Alright, uh, yeah. Mumbo will just turn me back. As is. I don't need to, need to go back in. This guy's gonna take a cheap shot on me. Yeah, Banjo 2 is just a little harder, a little long. Which is weird because it actually has fewer jiggies than this game does, but it still managed to stretch it out. <laughs> Vile, but worse, yeah. 
all the mini games in Banjo Tooie are like Mr. Vile that we just faced off against. I think this is the way I have to go. I don't think there are any other ways to go. By the way, is my oh, this is not the way I have to go. I don't think. Because this is the way to the next level. After. After the one I'm about to go to. Alright, I don't want to go there just yet. I think my frame rate is kind of low because uh, I was actually going to restart my computer before recording this. But the thing is. Uh, uh, Windows 10 had the good graces to warn me that and say, hey, if you're gonna if you're gonna restart, I'm gonna update. Thank you, Windows 10. I guess I'll just deal with the fucking this shitty ass frame rate. Or maybe that's just because of the emulator. Is this the way to freeze easy uh, peak? I just had to go upstairs, right? And that's where the uh, that's where I find it. Well then, let's go back in through the same doorway. How long have I been recording? Ended the last one at 17, so it's been 10 minutes now. Maybe I'll briefly excurs into Freeze Easy Peak before, uh, before ending it. Yep, uh... All right. It's weird that they put level six before five in terms of overworld. Oh, yep, yeah, this is the way. This is the way. All right, I think. Oh, I got to shoot eggs at it. All right. And that's something that, uh, oh, yeah, I've been I've been on for a while now. I believe this is the way to unlock Gobi's Valley, which is the sixth one that I was just talking about. The sixth level. Yeah, all right, I'm staying out of here. And then beyond that, Mad Monster Mansion and so on and so forth. All right, let's see what else I can do in the... Oh, yeah, here's a... Return of the... Uh... Hello? Okay, I must have already met this guy in this, in this uh, playthrough. But he's like... Hey, if you touch my eggs again, if you touch my honeycombs again, you'll be sorry. Oh, hey, there's a shortcut here now. I can warp back to the beginning of the overworld. But I choose not to because there's no reason for now. A big old... Yeah, O L apostrophe? Nah. O L E is the way to go. All right, I don't have enough of that one yet. Maybe this is the way to Mad Monster, or maybe that's the way to Rusty Bucket Bay. I don't remember. What's up, dude? Have I unlocked one of you yet? Nope. That's fine. Uh. All right, so here's this weirdo. I don't know what I don't know what his deal is, but we're gonna ignore him from now. For now, yeah, I don't want to. Looks kind of creepy to be honest. I don't really want to associate with him. <laughs> oh my god! Anyone who's watched probably one or a few of my first seven will know that <laughs> will know that I'm joking there. I've already interacted with her, yeah, it's a her, I know. But, uh... After I recorded the, uh... Well, the first ten parts, really. I had to start a new game because my hard drive crashed, as I mentioned. So, every time I talk to her in, in episodes one through ten, it's all moot because she has a new set of information for me now. I mean, spoilers, we won't get to that till later. Oh, this is a thing that I cannot even come close to completing right now because I absolutely need the shoes for those. 
But we'll get some other goodies along the way. Ah! That was ear shattering. And flight pad shattering. Can I not go this way? Alright. So I think we might be able to catch it here, but there's something above me? No? Okay, maybe not. I think there's a door up there, though. Wait, patterns? 256 different patterns? I thought... I thought each game had, like, one streamline of stuff that it could, uh... Be like, like, I thought each game had its own very specific set of uh, information that it could have. Alright, so we got a new move waiting for us. In the freeze easy. Freeze easy. This game is going to be easy. So, next time on Banjo-Kazooie, we'll slide our way down this ramp right here. Goodbye! Alright, let me actually stop the recording this.